Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, kids of all ages, welcome back to another episode of RB Plays All of Fabric 3. That's right, folks, we're back in our modded world. My name is RB Plays. I am your humble host on this side of the screen. Thanks so much for stopping by. If this is your first time here. Please do consider hitting that subscribe button, get notified every time we put new content up on the channel. Uh, last time we were together, which uh, was a while ago, and I want to apologize for that because uh, life, life has gotten in the way and I haven't had a whole lot of opportunities to record. I actually had to cancel my Wednesday live stream this week. And um, so I'm, I'm trying to get back in here and trying to get some content out for you guys. And I hope that you are ready for it. Um, <clears throat> so the last thing that we actually did in this world, we actually were in a live stream uh, this past weekend and we, uh, we reset up our enchanting area. It probably won't stay here, but this is what we've got for right now. We also set up a little kitchen area uh, complete with pickles. We have pickles. So we can make sandwiches. Um, we also have a place to uh, to create cheese. Uh, I have not tried to create the cheese yet. Uh, so, you know, oops, that's not how that works. That's not how that works. Mistakes were made. Pickle, pickle, cool. Uh, we also have a toaster so we can toast bread and a sandwich board and sandwich table and all that good stuff. So, yeah, we should be able to get into some, uh, some different food. I'm still kind of proud of the MREs because the MREs do a lot of, uh, they do a lot of saturation and a lot of food haunches and, uh, <clears throat> so I'll probably stick with those, but we, we set this up in a live stream because we just, we were looking for something easy to do and, and it kind of works, kind of works in that space. Uh, although it is not going to be centered since this is an even numbered space, that's an odd numbered space, kind of weird. Uh, we may change that out a little bit more, make it a little bit more appropriate. Um, today, oh, also we have done some, oops, gotta be standing right in the center of these. Uh, we also set up some mining operations in our last episode and uh, and they're working out very very well you can see that the miner here is actually 100 percent done uh, and it has done a fine fine job we ended up actually ended up with almost a stack of diamond ore out of this mine right here and then we also have uh, this mine over here which i went ahead and put our uh, our upgraded solar onto and uh, and it's been doing well also i think this one's done too uh, indeed it is, and uh, and we've done well, so we'll sort that out. We got uh, one, two, three and a half stacks of iron, plus I've taken a little bit out. Uh, so that is super cool. I'll move this to another place. Uh, not sure exactly where yet, but that's not important because what we're going to do today is today we're going to work over here uh, in this general area right here, including, ow, I fall down, uh, including right there where we have our uh, where we have the other miner. Since that area right there is clear, I want to get set up with a, uh, a tree farm. We need a tree farm because we need a good steady supply of charcoal, and we also are going to need another tree farm uh, for this stuff here. We want to be able to make rubber uh, for our uh, Tech Reborn stuff, and the best way to do that that I've seen is to have some kind of uh, some kind of tree farm that will harvest that and then send the uh, the rubber logs to uh, an extractor and the extractor will give us all the rubber that we need. So the tree farm that we're going to use is going to be this one right here. If we go inside here and we set it to show range, uh, the range on this thing is pretty gigantic, right? It's super big. Uh, so if we go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So it's eight plus eight is 16 plus one in the middle is 17. So it's a 17 by 17 area that, uh, uh, that this guy uses. And that could be, uh, that could be beneficial for us. So what we're gonna have to do is we're gonna have to make sure that we've got plenty of solar because I want this thing to operate off of solar. What I wanna do is make it operate off of solar so that it plants and harvests the trees. As long as you put uh, an ax in here, saplings and bone meal, then you should be able to continuously plant, grow, and chop down trees. And then everything that you harvest will go here, including saplings and all that. Um, there's also an upgrade that you can put in here that you can use to increase the internal storage. I don't know if that increases this internal storage or just this, but uh, we'll figure that out when the time is right. Um, but yeah, I think, I think I'm ready to move this over there and kind of get it set up to be our ultimate and be all and end all uh, kind, of, uh, kind of place where we're gonna grow trees. I would like to have access underneath of it so that we can get to this in case the like the axe breaks, we can get to it to uh, from the underside so that we can actually put a new axe in just in case. I haven't quite worked out all the details on how we're gonna get items. Hello, hi Raiders. You're not supposed to be coming because over here, 
and this is still in the render distance, I think, uh, in the live stream, we also captured another one of these guys. So we have, uh, we have a flag guy. See, hi, we got a flag guy there. That's, um, from what I was told, that's not supposed to happen. They're not supposed to get, we're not supposed to get new raiders if we have one captured. Anyway, nighttime cometh. So I'm going to go ahead and take a nap. And then uh, when I, when I wake up, we're going to go ahead and get an area over here prepared for, uh, for the tree farm. I think it's going to be, uh, I want to say that the best place to put it might be right off the corner here. But again, it's huge. So it's 17 by 17. So we're going to have to clear out a nice big 17 by 17 area uh, to make that happen. So let me take a nap and gather up some materials. And when I come back, I'll make this happen. <laughs> Okay, so I think this is how I want it. Um, so we've got a, a 17 by 17 area here. I did make a few little mistakes. I don't know if you caught that or not. I went a little too far here, so I'll have to cut that back a little bit. Uh, but I might actually take this all the way around and it'll make kind of like a great big bowl kind of a shape, which could be kind of cool i don't know uh but anyway in here we need to uh, we need to do some stuff we need to get a uh, uh we need to get an axe we need to get some saplings we need to get some stuff like that and we also are going to need to uh excavate out underneath this so that we can uh so that we can get our uh like our chest and everything that we're going to use to um <clears throat> So that we can get a chest that we can use to uh, to uh, uh, store our items in and so forth, and then we're going to need to get it tied into uh, into our slot link uh, storage system, which uh, which will be cool. I think we'll be able to get that done today. But anyway, what I want to do first is there's some new or some different cables that I haven't tried yet, um, and it was by uh, it's pipes I think pipes nope not there down here. E I P E pipe. Yeah, these guys. Uh, so I got these pipes from Easy Pass, 
Um, and I want to try and make some of these. So can I make a oh, recipe not unlocked in the book? Uh, uh, hold on. Let's see. Can we do this? Somebody in the, in the comments of a video recommended this. So if we do uh, recipe, yeah, recipe, give, take. Hmm. I don't know if that's what I want or not. I'm gonna mess. I'm not gonna mess with it because I don't want to. I don't want to. I don't want to get like cheaty or anything. But here, so here's the problem. Slot Link monitors um, recipes that are unlocked in your vanilla crafting book, right? From what I understand. And if you haven't unlocked a recipe, then it doesn't. It doesn't think that you know how to make it, and it won't actually let you make it. Apparently, that's gonna get updated in a new version of Slot Link, but um, but it's not working in this one. So let's just do it this way. Let's just go inside. Out. Let's go inside and get some and get the stuff that we need. So we need iron and glass, right? Iron. We have ooh, we have some iron, and we also need glass. Is it glass or is it glass panes? It is glass panes. Hmm. Okay. So give me, give me that. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Give me those. Give me sand because we have. We have a fair bit of sand, right? Yeah, we do. So we can bring that over here. We can start cooking that up. That'll work. Get some glass out of that and then come over here. So we should be able to do glass, panes, and then this. So that'll give us pipes. There are iron puller pipes, gold puller pipes, diamond puller pipes, and ender puller pipes. I think we need these in order to take items. Oh, and there's also a pipe probe. Uh, what's it take to make the pipe probe? That plus a nugget, not enough materials. Can I get some nuggets? Can I get some nuggets, please? Uh, nuggets, just need one. And a stick, a stick would be great. Yeah, a stick, uh, or was it two sticks? It might've been two sticks, let's get two sticks. Uh, so we need that, and then, no, it's just one. Okay, cool, we need that. And then we need these, uh, these. Oh, what are we got? Just colored pipes, right? Okay, so we just need basically these. So let's go ahead and make us, can we make a bunch of those? Hey, look, new recipes. We'll probably be able to make it slot with slot link now. Can I just do, I mean, that's, that's a fair number. Uh, iron puller pipes, so we're gonna need hoppers, cobblestone, and stuff like that. So, can I make that in here? Nope, recipe not unlocked. Of course it's not. <sighs> it's annoying, it's frustrating. Uh, do I have any hoppers? I do have hoppers, cool. So I can make a couple of those puller pipes. We're gonna need cobble. Uh, we can put you away, no, not. I don't know what that's all about, but it. It keeps grabbing items that I'm not grabbing, and I'm not happy about that. Slot Link has some Slot Link has some issues, y'all. I'm just I'm just here to tell you. Uh, and then redstone, right? Redstone. Yeah. Okay. So that should do that should do the trick. So we just need to make a polar pipe. Check. Okay. If I make two of them, if I make two of them. Yeah, if I make two of them, I think I can make what I want to work, work. So here's my thought. Um, take the take these puller pipes and bring them over here, right down here. We dig a hole underneath this guy right here. I think this is how this works. So if we take, really? Uh, if we take this uh, puller pipe, this one right here, I think what this does is it pulls items out of this, right? And that's what we're gonna want for uh, for all of the stuff that's in here. Um, what I don't know is, do you pull that out? Doesn't appear to. Oh, oops. And does it also also does it do it if there's if there's no inventory for it to go into? Like if we do this, I have no idea how this works. We need a we need a chest. Give me a chest. Yes, please. 
probably put those away. We'll put the chest there. We'll put the pipe there. Nope, nope, nobody, nope. And if we put you, oh, I can't put you in there because you don't go in there. Uh, uh, sticks might go in there though. Nope. I'll put slots. Nope. Okay, that's a bummer. Let's just. Ah, uh, that's better. That's more gooder. All right, so we just need to basically get this thing to plant and cut down a tree and then see if that actually works. I don't know why I did this. This is dumb. That's better. Can I do, can I put, uh, can I put saplings in there? I might be able to put saplings in there. Nope, that's not where I wanted to look. Boy, you know, you can tell that it's been a few days since I have recorded because I am absolutely making mistakes on this. Can I put you guys in there? Yes, I can. Well, that's gonna work. So as you can see, it plants the trees, right? And if we do, we're going to need to get power. We're going to need to get power to this. Can we, can we take a, can we take a solar panel and just put it way up there and do a cable all the way down? That, that's going to look like sin. That's going to look ugly as sin. Actually, you know what we should do? We should probably just do this. Just dig this out on each of the four sides. That way we have a place to put uh, all of the stuff that we're going to need. Um, but this is gonna need to be solar, so yeah. If I put this solar generator all, all the way over, all the way over here. Like if I put this solar generator, maybe if I put it back here. You know what? I'll tell you what. Let me come back in just a minute. I'll figure this out, and we'll uh, we'll be able to figure. We'll uh, we'll be able to wrap this up. Okay, so we've got power applied, and it's actually already started to chop down trees. Uh, apparently, it can't chop that. Oh, hey, hi, look. You're chopping down trees. And uh, this is actually working. So with this configured, uh, using this wrench, this, with this configured to output uh, on the bottom, it will take everything and put it down into, uh, into that bottom chest. So now we just basically need to break that chest and take it all the way out there so that items can get put into this. Now, the one thing I'm not sure about yet is uh, with using this probe, uh, it says that there is uh, white lists and black lists and all that good stuff, but I don't know how to do the white lists and black lists. So that is, uh, what is that? That's easy pass, right? Yeah. So if we go in here and do at easy pass, uh, that is not, that is how you spell easy pass. Um, Oh, that's E X. Ha ha ha. E Z P A S. There we go. Is there a filter that we can use? So there's no filter there. There's no filter there. That doesn't look like. Oh wait, that's this. Oh, that's a filtered pipe. That's a regular pipe. That's a filtered pipe. Okay, so we need to change these to a different color. Can we do that? What dyes do I have? Uh, D I D Y. Yeah, D Y E. I have yellow dyes. Can I make it a yellow? That's a yellow stained pipe. Can I make it a yellow filtered pipe? Black filtered pipe, white stained pipe. I can only make it white and black filtered pipe. Okay. So how do I make a filtered pipe? Uh, black filtered pipe. That is a pipe. Oh, really? Really? Truly? Ugh. Well, that's going to be not very cool. We can do that. We can... Hello? Hello? It has to be in a 3x3 three three, it looks like. That's interesting. I'm gonna do that here. You no. Thank you. 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 Oh. All right. Let's go inside and see if we can do it there on an actual crafting table because again, slot link is being stupid and I need food. Aha. Anyway, so you go there. You go there. Nope, still doesn't make the filtered pipe. Uh, oh, it has to be a white filtered pipe. How do you make a white filtered pipe? Oh, really? That's how you make a white filtered pipe? Do I have any cobwebs? Doubt it. Uh, um, I doubt I have any cobwebs. Cobwebs? Nope. 
how do you can you make cobwebs? No. Have to get them. Ooh. That. You have to get them with shears. Hmm. Shears and silk touch. Uh, shears plus silk touch. With shears and with silk touch. So you can get them either way. Hmm. Unfortunately, I don't have a man I don't have a mine shaft. Alright, so filtered pipes may not be in our cards for today, unfortunately. I do need some food though. I need potatoes. I do have some potatoes. I am out of MREs because I need to make bread. I don't have any I don't have any uh, wheat, so I can't make that. So we'll just eat potatoes. Uh, let's go back outside. Let's go this way. So filtering is not a thing that we can do just yet but that is okay actually are you getting power yeah you're getting power slowly that's cool all down you're doing fine ish cool so apparently there's a yeah see that is outside of the range of capabilities is there a range upgrade for this a range speed upgrade buffer upgrade i don't think there is fortunately it doesn't look like it that is truly truly unfortunate it's like very very unfortunate so we can get items over here where it's not so loud we can get items out of there and we can trade we can bring them down to over here right like we can put a chest down here and and that should be fine um but how do we get them back oops hello how do we get them back to that's an interesting that's an interesting that's an interesting trouble that we're having there but it's harvesting like a champion. All right, I'll tell you what. Let me break that thing down there. Let me get that chest out of there. Let me just work on getting items back over here. I wonder if we can just use the non-filtered pipes and take uh, take an inventory back over there, just using the other um, the other uh, the other iron polar pipe that we have. We might be able to do that. So let me let me get that let me get that squared away real quick, and I'll come right back to you. Okay. One last test for science here, and I think we're going to be in good shape. It's going to look ugly as sin because uh, I don't know of any way that you can actually select multiple sides or multiple outputs or inputs from the same side with this mod, so not sure exactly how that's going to work. But if we take this and we do this and we put it like this and we go like that, oh, that's not the way we want it to go. Try that again. If we go like this <laughs> and go like that, is he going to pull items out? No. No, he will not. What if I do that? No. Uh-huh. Oh, wait. Hold on. Wait. Hold on. Maybe we do this. Okay. Hold on. Uh, give me my wrench. And give me this. And do this. Getting saplings. Is it pulling saplings out of here? It is pulling saplings out of there. Oh, baby. Okay, that. That is a good thing. So it should pull all of those saplings out. It should plant all of the saplings, yeah? in the middle of a chopping cycle right now. But I think that's gonna work. I wish, I kinda wish you could see them in here. And like the old build craft pipes, that would be cool, right? Like that would be really, really, really cool. I think that's gonna work though. I think that's gonna work. Although, <laughs> uh, we're, we're getting a lot more trees than we know what to do with here, aren't we? Oh, okay, hi. That's, that's fine. Oh, baby. Yeah, we got lots of stuff in here. We're doing good. 
Uh, all right, I think I'm gonna let this run for a minute and I'll check back with you guys one more time before the end of the episode, but I think, I think we kind of have a working thing here, you know? I got another solar panel here. Maybe I'll add it over there and we'll get more power. That could be a thing. Okay, uh, it is most definitely working. Like it's working pretty well. I think we could probably improve on it some, but essentially this is what we got. So let's come down here. So we've got a, uh, we've got a, um, what's the thing called, a chopper. Uh, as long as there is a an ax and saplings in here, you can put bone meal in here too to make it grow faster. But as long as there's an ax and saplings in here, it will continue to plant and harvest as the trees grow. Uh, as there's as there's empty spaces, it will it will plant the saplings. As there are uh, trees grown, it will chop the site uh, chop the trees down. And it seems to go in cycles, right? So while it's chopping, it's not planting. While it's planting, it's not chopping. At least that's the way that it would appear. All of the items are pulled out with this iron puller pipe, and they go down these uh, these pipes from Easy Pass into this chest. This chest has another iron puller pipe coming off of it with a series of uh, cables or pipes or whatever you want to call them there. And those go all the way back over to right there. And then they go up and they go into the side right there right there uh, and they just put the saplings back in that works because the only thing that is at, that's able to be input into here is bone meal axes and saplings if there if it were if there were any way that you could put the uh, like the oak logs back in there it would try to pull the oak, oak logs out and pull those in as well but uh, if we go over here and look we should see that pretty much every space not every space yet but pretty much every space is filled with saplings which is very, very cool. That's so cool. Uh, we've got three solar panels here. These are the uh, two of these are the solar panels that we were using for our uh, for our miners. So we'll have to make some more of those. But uh, they are all full uh, on power. They are all transferring as much power as they can using these older pipes, which we will definitely change those out for something a little bit more high power. But right now, this is working. So we're going to have. Uh, a little bit of uh, we're gonna have a little bit of wood right we're gonna have a fair bit of wood now we need to get this tied into our uh, our slot link storage system so if we go to slot link um, there should be an import pipe import yeah um, sure so we should be able to do that and then we should also be able to do uh, what is that uh, it's a Got a pipe? Cable. So we've got all of these cables as well. Get rid of those. Don't need this miner right now. Grab those. That might, we might be able to do that. I don't know. Uh, we can put this in there and those will go that way. I'm going to take this guy right here and I'm going to do this. I'm going to tell it to, ooh, uh, I'm going to tell it to blacklist. I'm going to tell it to blacklist saplings. So I want you, hello, I think I have to do this with an open hand. Uh, you, I want you to blacklist saplings. So now no saplings should come uh, should come in there. Oh, and also you need to be north. Uh, which way is this? That's south. That way, cool. So now if I put you in there, yep, that should be fine. Then we need to take the, then we need to take this and go into the side of our base, which I think, yep. Uh, all right, so, mm, what, what level is this? 63. We'll just go down like this. Right there. And that gets us in the base. Sweet. We'll cover this back up. That'll be easy peasy, rice and cheesy. Uh, we'll do that so that that is uh, no longer uh, a problem. And then we just got to get this cable, uh, like right up in here, I think. I think it's right up, I think it's right there. It should be right there. So let me do that real quick. I'll come back to you and then we'll sign off for the episode because I think that'll just about do it. Okay, home stretch here. This is just about have this tied in. Oh, actually, you know what? No, don't. Oh, you know what? I got a better idea. Don't tie that in yet. We could use one of the other, uh, one of the other cables. We could use a what is it? A link? Yeah, one of these linking cables. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. We'll try that. 
linking cable, please and thank you, yeah. Because what I was gonna say was, what we have out there is an import cable. I don't want the import cable. Man, that looks ugly as sin. Uh, <laughs> uh, anyway, I don't want a linking cable, or I don't want an import cable because I don't want the items to come into my inventory. I just want a linking cable so that I can kind of get an idea of what's out there, right? So let's change this. Change this from this cable right here to, uh, to this cable right here, right? Now we know what's in it, yeah? So now we'll go back inside and tie this together and we should be able to see a bunch of, well, okay, so how much oak do we have in here right now? So oak, we have 350 pieces. If we put this cable in place right here, how many pieces do we have now? Oak. Oh yeah, 1.1K. I like it. I love it. That's amazing. Ah, and sadly, folks, that's all the time I have for today. So thanks so much for watching. Sorry so much that it has been so many days since the last episode, but thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, may you know what to do. Make sure you hit that like button. Also, don't forget to subscribe. Likes and subscriptions help out oh so immensely when it comes to those pesky YouTube search results. The other thing that helps out a lot is comments, so make sure you leave your comments right down here in the comment section below and we'll chat about it. Leave your tips, your tricks, your pointers, your attaboys, your what in the world were you thinking, all that good stuff, and we'll chat about it in kind. Don't forget to stop by our Discord server where we talk about all things life, all things gaming, and all things Minecraft. Once again, folks, that is all the time I have for today. Thank you so much for watching, and until next time, we will catch you on the flip side. We'll see you later. Bye-bye.